Hi, this is Jack Ma with Jack Ma Real Estate Group here at Century 21 Masters. Today, we're going to talk about some real estate terms. You may have heard the terms buyer's market or seller's market. So exactly what's a buyer's market and what's a seller's market and how are they determined? So simply put, a seller's market happens when there are more buyers on the market than sellers and due to the law of supply and demand, that gives the seller more leverage when it comes to negotiating. Common trends we are going to see during a seller's market are multiple offers, quick sales, and price appreciation. It is also harder for a buyer to negotiate repair credit because during a seller's market, buyer fear of not finding another home to buy or they fear the prices continue going up. And on the other hand, a buyer's market happens when there are more buyers on the market than sellers. There is yet another imbalance on the supply and demand curve. Now buyers are getting the upper hand because there are more homes for buyers to choose from. Trends we're going to see are longer marketing time, multiple offers are far in between, dropping of prices, and more transaction getting canceled and falling through. Now that you know the difference between the two, how are they determined? So the calculation I like to use are by month inventory or what we call it absorption rate. Some of you may be thinking, what well, Jack, I don't like math. But before you panic, take a deep breath. Trust me, it's very easy. So assuming there are 100 homes on the market for sale and 25 homes sold in the last 30 day period. So you simply divide 100 by 25 and what you get? Four. So you are looking at four months of housing inventory. So see how easy that was? And I did promise you that it'll be easy, right? So generally speaking, if there is less than four months of inventory, we are in a seller's market. If there is more than six months of inventory, we are in a buyer's market. And anything in between is indication of a neutral market. There, now you know how to determine the market. This is a tool that will help you decide on how aggressive you have to be during negotiation, whether you're buying or selling. So what type of market do you think your city is in? Send me an email, leave me a message, and let me know what you think. If you want to find out more about this topic, more specific on any real estate trends or questions, feel free to reach out to me at 909-610-5188. Again, thank you very much for watching this video.